Hey everybody, this is Chris with the Ancient Scholar, and this is going to be your Medical Mad Minute. So in this particular short, I'd like to talk about cephalosporin cross-reactivity with patients that have penicillin allergies. And I want to tell you all right now that if you are thinking about giving a third-generation cephalosporin and beyond, the third-generation and cephalosporins and beyond, ceftriaxone, etc., uh, do not contain the R1 side chain that seems to be responsible for most of the cross reactivities that we see in patients that have true penicillin allergies uh, that may be at risk if they receive first and second generation cephalosporins. So in conclusion, if they are receiving a third, fourth, fifth generation cephalosporin, the risk of a cross reactivity is incredibly low.